This is Scott C. Waring of UFOSightingsDaily.com and I have found some UFOs in some Apollo 10 photos. Yes, I'm still in the index. I'm still looking at them. And as you see from the GIF, here's three photos put together. You see one, two, then it goes back to the moon. This is the moon down here. And this is a UFO. Look at that. And you see it moving further from the original. Now this is a close-up of it. You see it's like an arm-like UFO, which has been described by one astronaut that was in the space station uh, a while back. And here it is the same one, but moved positions. Kind of looks like a, a t one, two arm with a third arm coming up. Very strange, isn't it? Okay, I found that in the Apollo Image Atlas. I was looking through these photos and I found it right up here. And here is the original, and it's a NASA source. Here is another one, and another one. This one has no UFO. This one has a UFO very far out here. This one has a UFO just beginning to come out. Okay, you see it's not attached to anything. The object is actually um, not attached to anything at all. You see there's no arm that keeps going. It's just right here. And it stops right here. It's very long, but it stops. Looks like there might be a window or something there, too. So this is an alien UFO from the Apollo 10 index when they were taking photos of the moon. Uh, let's see if I can... Here is an enlarged picture of it. Let me try to move it over a little bit so you can see it. This is a full uncut one. Now, if I make it bigger, bring it over, <coughs> you can see that this object is very unique. Oops, sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, here we go. Uh, let me see, I can't really make it. I already had it made larger right here, so I'll just, I'll just pull this out here. Here's one, and here is the other, which is kind of unique, I think. Uh, you see two different views of the same UFO. This is actually showing that this one rotated. And you cannot see the other arm going this way, but you can here. It's very un unusual, very unique. And I wonder, is it one of those biotechnology biotechnology ships, uh, grown, genetically grown ships, or it might actually be an animal, but it doesn't look like it. From the shape of it, it doesn't look like some giant animal out there. Uh, because as you know, I just reported talking to an astronaut last night, and he said he saw an alien organic creature outside his window that was white looking, that looked alive. Uh, so. Look at this, pretty unique. He said it was kind of tubular, and this is tubular, kind of arm-like, exactly like he described. All right, you decide, is this a UFO, or is this our imagination? This is Scott C. Waring of UFOSightingsDaily.com, trying to bring you the truth every single day, whether NASA likes it or not. Okay, guys, see you at UFO Sightings Daily. Please like and subscribe.